Hey guys, today I'm reviewing Thin Tea Detox and this is their 14 day de detox. I gave this detox tea three out of five stars. So I found it to be slightly better than your average detox tea. Um, this comes with obviously two teas, one for the morning and one for the nighttime. And it's a both of them are loose leaf teas, which I like tea bags better just because loose leaf teas create an extra step in putting them in the infuser. Um, but it's not that big of a deal. Both of these you um, steep for three to five minutes um, in boiling water. So that's easy enough. Um, you don't really need to worry about over steeping these ones too much because neither of them have senna, but they both contain dandelion root, which is a mild laxative. Um, but I would just stick to the instructions, but with, like I did, I brewed them three to five minutes. Um, so for 14 days, you just drink one in the morning um, with breakfast, this one, and then this one you drink before dinner, which I found kind of inconvenient to kind of chug a glass of tea before dinner. I think that they try and make you more full so you don't eat at dinner, but that didn't really have that effect on me. I just found it inconvenient to drink a full glass of tea before dinner. Um, the taste. So the morning detox tea tastes really bad. Um, it tastes like an herb or a spice, and I think it's the fennel seed in here. It had a very kind of strong flavor. It did grow on me as the days went on. I didn't hate it as much, but I never enjoyed it. Um, the nighttime tea, this one tastes pretty good. It's very minty, refreshing, a little on the stronger side, but um, it was overall pretty decent. Um, I, I didn't mind the taste at all. I didn't dread it like I did this one. Um, the ingredients. So both of these have pretty good ingredient lineup. Um, this one contains organic fennel seed. That's the one ingredient I don't really like. It contains estrogen in it, um, which always kind of scares me when you put hormones in your tea. I don't want it to mess with my natural hormone levels, um, but that's said to help with digestive issues. It also contains organic nettle leaf and marshmallow leaf. Um, that last one said to like help with inflammation, pain. Um, now this one, this contains organic peppermint, which is an ingredient that I love. It's said to help with a lot of different things. It tastes good. Um, it has olive leaf in it, which is an interesting ingredient with some kind of crazy claims about it. It's said to help prevent cancer, which I'm not sure I believe, but I don't think it hurts anything by having it in here. Um, they both contain dandelion root. Like I mentioned earlier, it's a mild laxative. It didn't really have a harsh effect on my body, so I don't mind it, but I wish they only included it in one of the teas instead of both. I don't think you need to have it twice a day. I think once a day would be enough. Now, the results I got while using this tea after the two weeks, um, I actually really liked the results. I felt a lot less bloated. I felt like I was losing weight, but I don't think it was solely from using this detox tea. They also have a thin tea eating plan that they recommend you strictly follow while using this, and I did, and I think that most of my results came from that. In order to get fit and stay fit, healthy eating is key, along with exercise. Um, but it had some good recipes on there, some tasty things, and I really enjoyed that. I don't think, I think that the, having the detox tea in addition to that helped boost my results and it definitely didn't hurt anything at all. But I felt um, great. I felt skinny, strong, um, definitely less bloated. As far as the side effects go, the only one I really noticed is neither of these teas have caffeine. So I was kind of dragging throughout the days. Um, I definitely needed some caffeine and I felt tired. I wish the morning one at least had caffeine in it so I could really get some energy to do my workouts in the morning. Um, and they, the, the, another good thing about this thin tea is they have a 14 day money back guarantee, which is great. It's rare to find a tea company that stands behind their products. You can try this one and if you don't like it, you can send it back. So there's very little risk in trying it. Um, so overall, I ended up giving this tea three out of five stars. And for more information on this detox tea and many others, please visit us online at detoxteaguide.com and on Facebook and Twitter.